All right there, guys, it's Metro, and we are back again, continuing directly from the last episode. I had to step away for about an hour or something, maybe more like 40 minutes, but yeah. No idea what we're doing. What is this? Say, take these flowers or feathers? Huh? What? Let's see, go in there. Oh, okay, I guess so. No idea, I don't... Uh, no, this is not... <laughs> this is where we started. I don't remember this at all, honestly. It's been a long time since I've done this raid. I don't remember having any trouble navigating it. Not off to a blistering start in the idea of speedrunning this place, but obviously at this point it's all new and progression, so... We'll probably have to relearn some things. I have no idea where we go. Actually, don't know. Uh, yeah, I have no idea. We'll figure it out together, guys. It's probably gonna be uh, something obvious. We just overlooked it. What is that? Oh, we can fly through here. Was this meant to be water? It looks like wind. No, we are not able to fly through here. I guess we're able to... What the fuck is even happening right now? Okay, cool. Let's just go the, the other way. No idea what we're doing right now. I feel like that door is supposed to be open. Oh, I missed the jump. Or did I? That happened the other day, I got stuck. I think I may have not missed the jump, I just got stuck and it looked like I missed it. Uh... What the fuck? Oh. That way, I guess. There's another way. Yeah, must be that, right? And that's it. And that's why that door is supposed to be open. You meant to just fly right up. Okay. The room of time. Is this the room? There's another boss first, isn't there? I remember mobs with these, these, or fights with these mob types, I believe. I don't remember what these mobs actually do. Maybe that's part of the de room encounter. What the fuck? What's happening? Am I mind controlled? This is gonna be an adventure, guys. Yeah, I guess I'm just getting mind controlled over and over again. MS or something? Nope. What? <laughs> what is happening right now? Is he picking me up? Oh, he's like picking me up and doing something to me, I guess. Yeah, I think this is part of the... I think there's a fight. There's another fight still. Right? I don't remember the names of these fights at all. Drew was the one with the eyes, I remember that much. I think this is the fight. Yeah, it is the fight. It's just really weird. Some weird encounter, basically. The only thing I remember of Darumu is the actual uh, maze, but I think there's like a whole other part of the fight that the maze is only a, one part of it. What's that? You meant to shine it. Ah, yeah. Okay. I remember this now. Why, though, is the question. Is this the encounter?
I have no idea. I guess not, because we're out of combat. Can we just grab all of these? something to do with something. I remember this being a very complicated fight strategically in Heroic. But I have no idea why. I can't remember much. I remember having to shine these lights on certain things and then kill certain things, but I don't remember why. I don't know if this is trash or why. I assume this is just trash. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. Maybe the fight is... I don't even know. Maybe we were just thinking about the trash the whole time. There's the boss, so yeah, it might honestly be just trash I was thinking about. Got a lot of fucking health. Do we even lust? I feel like we're probably good to do it, but we'll see. Lingering gaze. Drops a little puddle. Does that do something? Just damage and slow. Run away, little girl. Fine. Dodge attack. Please. Okay. That's why you want to dodge it, I guess. Some knockback. I had a feeling I was going to die there. We won't bother with drums because we don't really have enough of them to keep wasting them. They don't really help us that much anyway. The, power of the, void. the void? What? What's going on in here? Who the fuck is this guy and why is he in here? Is he a demon? It says he's an aberration, so that makes me think like, why is the void in here? What is the rumor's purpose in this raid? I don't understand. The forgotten, it says as well. It's a very strange model as well. I think it's awful. I thought that was going to be at me. Oh, okay. Here's here's how it works. I don't know why it works. Yes, this has something to do with something. <laughs> this is what I was thinking of. I meant to use these to reveal these mobs, but I have no idea why. Like, do, we need, do they need to die? I... Or can we just kill the boss? Taking a lot of fucking damage, I think. I can't really tell. It doesn't look like we are, actually. I think when you move, you take damage or something. Is that how it works? The frost beam is random. I guess they're both on me. No, that's not, yeah. I think one of them is meant to be on the tank. The green beam is random. And the, uh... The blue beam is meant to be on a regular player or something like that, maybe. Oh yeah, we're dead. We can't do this fight. What is this nonsense? Alright, well, I guess we're not doing this. Is it from the ads? It's gotta be from the ads, right? Serious wound. That should be in the dungeon journal, at least. No. That is a tank breaker, basically. From what I could tell. So is there any way to stop that? Doesn't look like it. Uh, we'll try it again. Maybe we learn something. Let's try to buff up a little bit. Still don't have our potions up. 
What do we have to do to transition? We have to probably get him to 60 or something, maybe? If we blow this, that'd be enough. Let's try it. Stairs where that's coming from, Four, I believe. Three, Maybe two, we can AMS it. One. Run away, little girl. Run uh, no. But I think we can just try to push through because he was at 70 there and I still almost didn't even die. And what the fuck is happening right now? Why am I taking so much damage? It's from the ice mob or something? I have no idea. I don't think... I'm not sure we can do this, to be honest. I don't even know what's happening, though, so I don't know if we can or can't. Why am I... Why am I still in combat? <laughs> For some reason, that was a lot more dangerous than the first pull. Try to do the ads. Right, figure out what the fuck's going on. Step one. Eventually gonna make the fight impossible though. That stacked up real quick, huh? Five, four, Pretty three, crazy. Two, one. Run away, little girl. Run okay. I didn't see the frost ad. We can actually just fight them though ourselves. See, what you're meant to have done was you're meant to, like, identify the locations of them and have people stand there ready to go. What is happening? I don't, I don't understand. What the fuck is going on? I guess I really need to pay attention to the frost thing or something? Very confusing. Very, very, very confusing. But honestly, this is how the fight was back in the day, too. It was a very complicated encounter. We haven't even got to what people would consider the hard part. So, yeah, let's just try to identify where the ice ad is, and hopefully if we kill that quickly, then that is now survivable. I think you're meant to do that, like, instantly. And then the fire ones you just can take your time on. Like if I remember correctly, the blue one was like, identify that instantly, and then the fire one was on the tank, I think. And one of them was on the tank, I don't know which one. Really, really, really weird encounter one way to there. Run away, little girl. Run away. Okay, blue's over there. This was before raid markers, so. Is it dead? What the fuck is going on, dude? What is happening? How am I taking this much damage? I have no idea what is happening. Why am I taking a million damage a tick from that? Like, if I'm failing it. I can't figure this out. It's not making any sense to me. I thought we got the ad. 
Let's try it one more time, man, but I don't know. Should I run out there and auto attack it? I cannot believe, like, I've not taken this much damage in any other encounter, so I'm very confused why we're taking this much damage. Seems very abnormal. Partially because of the healing reduction, I suppose, but we're still taking a million damage, which we only have three million health. It's like a million damage every second as well. It's really weird. Is there something maybe we AMS the first? Because I don't know how the hell we didn't have that happen the first time we got the mechanic. Try to AMS and vamp blood it, maybe? Four, three, two, one. Run away, little girl. Run away. Okay, we're AMSing. I guess I missed it already. I have no idea. Reacted too late. Oh, I mean, we're already dead because I don't even know what we're doing right now. This is bugged or something, surely, right? Like, what? This is just, how do people do this fight? What am I missing here? Why are people taking a million damage every second? Okay, I really need to try to pay attention to where the Azure one spawns at least, and maybe that does it for us. I think once you kill the ad, the beam goes away. Maybe that one's the one that's always on the tank and that's why it's so hard hitting or something. Very confusing fight. Like even chain failing, like killing the wrong head on Magira for five minutes straight, I never took that much damage. Run away, little girl. I see I'm not seeing them like I think it was over here you have to be really fucking on it to, to hit them no it wasn't over here Azure Fog here we go okay it's dead alright that was the hard part apparently now that that thing's dead we're not taking much damage but we still have to burn him before I get to the bad stacks of this shit. Which is not gonna happen, it looks like. What else are what else do we do here? We can actually attack him from that far away, which is interesting. Yeah, we're, we're now dead. Uh, I guess we can go back and try to burn him now that we know about that. But I, I don't know. I don't think we can do this. Like, I'm not sure how we make progress on this fight because we only got into 70 there and he's... I have 10 stacks of a debuff that makes me unhealable. Presumably the phase will will end. Like, that's my only hope, really. So we'll try one with like everything up and see if we can't burn him harder. But realistically, if we have to actually kill that ad and switch to it, it's probably gonna be too much time lost. Okay, as soon as this knockback comes out, we need to start, like, 
really paying attention Four, to where stuff three, is on the screen. Two, one. Run away, little girl. Oh, there's that. Uh... So that means it's got to be over here or something, I think. Because if I can't see it, that means it's got to be behind us, right? It's going to be an incredibly hard fight to actually make progress on because I have no idea where I'm supposed to be looking. It looks like if I don't reveal the ad, though, I don't take the crazy damage from it. I'm not really sure about that part. Maybe I'm wrong about that because I'm not dead. Oh, there was purple. What the hell is purple one? Is that an achievement? I think that's an achievement. It's probably an achievement. Yeah, it's already over. Uh, for some reason that time he didn't do any damage to me. So maybe I could have just burned him. No idea. I don't have enough drums to keep trying this though, but we can use the scrolls at least. I'd like to just see him transition once if I have any shot of doing that. Like, let's just try burning him as hard as we can. I don't really have, like... Th that's pretty much my full damage there. Like, there's not much damage we're gonna gain. Why just so that it feels like my DPS has been nerfed on this fight. Only 400k burst, really. Gonna ignore this mechanic and see what happens. Something's being missed because now we're taking. Oh, it's because we instantly broke the fog again. Uh, like what? Is that just bad luck? I think that's just bad luck. Just trying to ignore the mechanic, but the me the mob was there. Wait the no, okay, I can't be asked wait. We're not even getting a minute into the fight, so why bother waiting? Here it comes. Just basically look behind you and make sure there's no blue ad. Run away, little girl. Run away. Doesn't look like it. I think when the fog beast is revealed, then you take tons of damage or something. It's not really any point. Like AMS is not going to be valuable later on either, right? So we should try to use it as early as we can. He's only at 84, like, we're not gonna be able to burn him before he gets us to 10 stacks. Provided he has to get 60 or something, like 66, I'm hoping. I don't think this is doable. 
Unless somebody can tell me how to drop these stacks, I can't see how we would be able to do this. Alright, so let reveal the fog as well. Yeah, we're now immune to healing, so. No shot. Alright, well that's weird. I definitely thought we were going to have more success in here than that. So that's it. Let's hearth out. Done with that for the day, so I guess we'll just go do dailies or something. Get some power. Let's open all these. Should be 8k, I think, right? It's only 6k? Hmm. Yeah, I guess we only killed 6 bosses, yeah. Oh, and then these, still we have to open this, yeah. All right, very good. Now we can scrap all the stuff. Make ourselves even more. Oh, wall watchers poleaxe. Oh shit, is that, what the hell? Do we get that from that rare we killed at the beginning of the last episode? I think we did. Did I already have that one maybe? Cause I know there was a couple of things that I still wanted transmog was. Okay, so 11k bronze still only. That didn't give us really any bronze scrapping that stuff. Let's upgrade the boots, I guess. Okay. A couple more things upgraded. Probably should be upgrading the stuff that has the best damage, though, like Mark of Arrogance. Presumably that goes up a lot each level. But, uh, yeah, alright, let's just do the dungeon dailies, I guess, then that'll be the end of the episode after that. I already have them, of course, yep. Right? I guess so, yep, alright, random... Rook. Oh, 14 here. What the hell is he doing here? How'd you even get here? I guess he just dragon rode here, but you can't even do anything in the zone of 14. Getting hot already. When I did the last episode, I was like, oh, it's nice and cool out. <laughs> no longer nice and cool out. Supposed to be in the mid 90s again today. No rares at all, huh? Surprising. Yeah, we get this one a lot now. I really like that. That looks really good. That's one of the gems, right? Tinkers. These guys are gonna be fucking 
And their ass kicked out, it's like. Yep. But somebody at least is trying, they have the life gem thing on. Heard that's good. Although I don't necessarily know why. Doesn't seem like it does a lot. Too bad. Either being dead doesn't even matter, I don't think. Maybe for the conflagrate or something. Three DPS actually solid. Is that all we got? No, we got. Only the dogs of Clan Gothan. Yeah, a bunch of stuff, I guess. We don't see other people's threads, that's why I got confused, because I only saw the green stuff. What are they arguing about? <laughs> Never pay attention to this, I guess. Because somebody stole the treasure, is that what they're talking about? Exchange, but we are not fools. Your clans are clearly in league with one another. For the glory of our king, our empire, we will put you all down. I don't, I don't, I just don't get how people die, man. I really don't. people even doing? Is this fucking pet keeps taunting? I, I can't pass with this shit. I really don't like these dungeons, man. I really wish you can just solo this shit. Even if it took fucking 10 minutes longer, I'd happily solo it. Just uh, to deal with all this nonsense. guy even like 60. Oh that's 60, you need to be 70, right? <laughs> that's why. Where have you heard me complain about this before? Low levels should not be in heroics.
takes like fucking like five hours or something like that. I don't know why you wouldn't. Just level. Is there anybody? <laughs> Mugged's not resident, so. The warlock's back there. I guess he battle resident or something. They just released. No idea. Then these fucking reset, so we gotta drag everything back to this room. And they're already resetting. That's really, really weird. Yeah, what the hell is in there? For an achievement or something? Okay, just not gonna be here, huh? That's funny. It's actually crazy that they even make you queue up with the healer. I guess they didn't bother changing that. Nobody at any point needed any healing. Alright, we'll do the scenario as well. Still none. Zero rares. Which is really weird, I feel like. This one's up. What the fuck's going on? It was up. No longer up. Who's this one? Down up there. Two guys up here. Holy shit. Alright. Getting powerful now, I guess. Dead. Enter. Why we don't have the ability to? Well, the Darumu experiment really didn't go well. I guess we can do the first six at least, no problem. Guy with his head on taunt. This is probably the best one for speed.
These are lootable too, you gotta make sure you loot them. They don't get much, I guess. But once the next phase begins of this part, they go away. Good. Almost nothing, it seems like, so forget it. Doesn't seem like it matters. I oh, know they're not actually gone. He's here. Apparently those are dangerous. Do I have to wait or can I have random my corpse? Run away, little girl. Or they got him killed by now. We'll move on. That was speedrun strat. What is going on? They're still fighting those ones? Thought they were going to be easily dispatched. Why did we get a cash from killing them up? You don't have to actually do anything with that, right? Or do we? Yeah, do we have to open that? I think we probably did have to open that. gonna get feared if I run though. doing come on what are you doing doing like a, they got there's like a trash they need we need mob count I guess they're trying to get mob count come on, I'm just back there still attacking nobody you can't seem to hit people with this bolt so it just keeps trying and nothing's happening yeah that was bizarre What the fuck is going on? Do I have to kill this mom? I guess because I was in combat, it wouldn't let me leave the group. Well, that's that. I mean, we could do the normal dungeon or something. <laughs> they don't want to though, man. Those are just not fun. They're pretty much the only actual source of bronze. Those caches. They buffed bronze, but it's not really like buffed. It's just from those things. Which is kind of unfortunate because that stuff is not fun at all. Let's turn them in. Oh my god, how many times am I going to do this?
turn him in, then I guess we'll just go do the Golden Lotus dailies again, maybe, or something. Hail. Goodbye. Finish Shao Hao Rep. Yeah, maybe let's do that, actually. Let's go to Time Out for a bit. Somebody was saying that you can just farm frogs to get the coins really quick. If I want to get them out. It doesn't really sound like something I would like, but... I mean, it's better than... I feel like you gotta. I gotta get them out, right, while I'm here. A bit silly not to get it. That's the wrong place to do that. I accidentally taking any of my gear off right now. Okay. Another 11k, so that's good. Trust you for now. Belt, definitely first. And we can upgrade the rest, I think. Yes, we can. Alright, so that's another full level. 430 now. Uh, so yeah, we'll do... Oh wait, do we have one that wasn't? Oh no, that was a cloak. So how many... Le There's six left. Oh, there's eight left. Don't believe me. All right, let's go to Timeless Owl for a minute. Where's my item? There it is. We'll go kill, because somebody said the frogs still drop. Like, they still die and drop the coins and shit really quick, so. We'll go do that quick. What is this daily? What brings you These give a lot of coins too, yeah. Uh, let's try to finish some of this stuff, I guess. I think elite, the frogs are elite, aren't they? I think that's why they're so valuable. Now that we have PvP enabled... It doesn't do anything, does it? I don't think so. You have to actually have War Mode on, you can't just enable it. No, these guys aren't elites, I guess. I won't be able to do that. Oh, they are elites, even though they're not. <laughs> what? They still die really quick. <laughs> They have like no health. They don't even have a million health. I want this win one. How's that? We got Yulon. That's probably good too, though, I guess. Yeah, we'll be able to finish this quick. How many timeless coins do we need? We need a lot. I think we only have half, and it's like 100,000 or something, isn't it? Yeah, I think it's 100k, and we, only have, we don't even have 50k. 
But if we just did the dailies every day, we'd get... Like, this is a very efficient way to do all the dailies, too, it looks like. Well, minus the rares, we still gotta do the rares. Killing, yeah, just killing a few mobs, 72 coins, so. They honestly die too quick. You can't, I feel like I can't loot some of them. Yeah, like, see, I missed that one. That one didn't even move from its spot and it died. An actual rare. Actual elite, I mean. Lots of rares up, but I'm not gonna go up there quite yet. Is the rare one to Shao How? One of them, like, I keep. No, it must be Path of the Mist Walker that I keep. The other ones keep getting reset on me, it feels like. What the hell is that? Because the frogs don't drop threads at all now, right? happened there <laughs> one fucking spawned in my D&D &D and I didn't even realize I was attacking it and it died before I even realized I was attacking it This happened again. Yeah, okay. Uh, well, we are up to 45k coins, so... If we truly need 100k, this is not that fast. I think it's not a bad idea to try to come and do the dailies every day. Should I prioritize doing this over the raid, I guess? I think we can probably do both. Uh, maybe not. The thing about doing this is it's like I have a portal to. Oh, boop pops up as well. I have a portal here. So I can start with the raid. And then port here after we're done with the raid, since we can only do up to G Con it seems. We'd start like really getting into the speed running element of it. Whoa. 
couple more seconds still. But he's attacking me, so. Come on. Is he gonna reset if I keep moving over here? Oh, I wasn't paying attention. That's funny. That's humorous. He, wait, it was him applying it too. That's why. That's humorous. What great humor life offers. Just died to the fucking frogs and I'm one shot. In. That's why I initially said, like, this is not a good farm. Before I realized that people were just one-shotting them. Like if you were choosing to grind these mobs on your own, you'd probably have that happen more than once. Oh, that gives, that gives threads. Zwen, 15% damage, that's the one. Not like we need it. I missed with the D and D yet again. That happens a lot. Try to put D and D down in between two targets and miss. Should we try to get the rares kill? I mean, maybe we can still do it. We have some time still. I can I can stay a little bit longer. It would be another thousand. Of the thing are majabbers. Let's try to shoot up to there and get that one started. Uh, yes, we'll make it. Oh, we don't even need to blink. That's cool. Oh, we'll do it. Alright, let's see. Let's kill this and then we gotta go find three more. And that'll be that for today. Can't mount here anyway. Uh, leaf Monder. Uh oh, big time leafy. Ma oh, we're gonna die here. I don't have the thing on anymore. Okay, don't die. Somehow I didn't get in combat there. Leafy Mons, just sitting there, one million health. This guy's got negative health compared to most rares. He's dead. Does that count as killing a rare? Technically. All we need to do is sit here and wait for the trio, though. Like, that's overpowered as shit. Because you get credit for two. It's like Mop already has crazy good value for just killing mobs. Everything we kill has a... Uh, has some coins, you know. And on top of that, you got the bronze and everything else. Watch her Osu is up. It's one of these guys or something? I'm not sure, to be honest. Looks like it, yeah. It's gotta be in here, right? There's nobody here. Guess it's not in here. Oh, there's somebody there. Oh, somebody's attacking Ordos. Uh, will we make it? No, unlikely. Stop attacking him. Yeah, we will make it. Alright, there's always someone in it, too. 
Fine by me. You don't count as a rare though. Just get the loot instantly. Greater spool, let's see what we get. 540 mastery. I still have no idea what Watcher Osu is. I think he he's on this island somewhere, but maybe he's dead already. I don't know. It'd be hard to get the rares because like they're pretty much instantly killed when they're spawned. Flint Lord Garion's up though. Just hanging out over here. Where is he? Purple. Love seeing that. All right, now I just need one more. These guys aren't up, obviously, but let's kill these and drop down. How about him? Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Uh, is this thing gonna be up? It's like clickable. I don't know if that's an indication that it's gonna be up. Don't I still have one of those scrolls or did I use it? It says that it's locked. Champion of the Black Flame are up now. That's funny. Alright, we'll head back up there. I think. Oh, that's not gonna work. Uh, and then they just summon Arcus of the Flame. Oh my god, I'm so all over the place. Can we get back down there in time? I don't have the, the fall rune on anymore, so. It's only like, yeah, I only have like 30 seconds to fight him. I have to get down there. Yeah, we're not gonna make it. Nope. Fuck! This shit is hard to get rares, man, because of how... I, I'm putting that other thing back on. Which one is... I think Fervor sucks, honestly. I'll remember to... Uh, if I remember, I will try to remember to put it back on afterwards, but... If we're doing world content, I gotta have this thing, because I'm gonna die a lot. Well, that's unfortunate. I don't know why... I, what happened to my scroll? Did I use it? I guess I used it at some point. All right, come on, one more rare. I gotta get going. Just look at our rare. I am honored. Bolkenar, over there. All right. Throw a fucking meteor at it. That's gonna. We're gonna land on the bridge, probably. Where's Golgonar? There. Then we'll have been, wait, what is this? This is from like way before when I was over here. Okay. That was like a 30 minutes ago that I was here, wasn't it? Why wait? We just kill shit. And free stuff. I don't really get why people just sit there and wait. You know exactly when it's gonna spawn. I guess they worry about it getting one shot. Alright, well we did finish them all. That's good. Go turn all this in, and then that'll be it for today. Should end up with 50k. We'll finally get 50k 
take a look at how much we actually need. I'm pretty sure it's 100k though, which I don't see myself getting to be honest. Because even if we did all three of those every day, it's just it's just too much shit, dude. <laughs> like it's just not possible for me playing only an hour to two hours a day to get all this. It's gonna take months. I'm not the kind of guy who's just going to sit here and farm up. So I can't do it. You can go tag that, though. You are most Where's that? I just want to see the mount real quick. Yeah, it's 100k, so... Probably not getting that. But it's another stretch goal, maybe. We decide to check it out at some point, we'll see. There's not like if I want the mount, like there's only this is the best way to get it for sure. Never gonna be an easier way to get it. Alright, now it's hot. I got now I'm actually sweating already. No more cool breeze that we had this morning. Of your actions. I think I was trying to actually attack us. He's also been in PvP. Man, Fury Warrior just looks so fucking awesome. This trial. It's really May crazy. Ever light your way out of Where's the loot? Did we places. not get loot? What just happened? The trial of wisdom and learn of the what? We don't get credit for that because we weren't there when it started, I guess? It's bizarre. Can I assist you? All right, well, that was a waste of time. All right, anyway, um... Well, we have 50k on the dot, so yeah, we're... After all we've done on this island, we're only halfway there, so that's... Yeah, I don't think we're getting that one. We can't do both. We can't farm the raid 6,600 6, rep at a time. Let's actually do the math on this. Since we now know how long it actually takes us. Let's actually do the math on this. And the gems that we can disenchant first. There's a nice cool breeze coming back. Pull me off again. It's only 11 o'clock. We're just when. Someday they come. Go away. Look at this guy. He's standing right on top of the thing. Anyway, back to 2.7k bronze. Uh, okay, uh, so let's do the math on this. I want to see how many more runs of TOT is going to cost us, provided we can only do six bosses a day. So it is. We are currently honored. So let's say twelve minus eight two nine nine. So we need three thousand more rep there. So that's tomorrow. That's done. I don't actually know how much rep you need total though. Let's see rep. I think it's Nexus 24k? 21. Wait, what? Is that right? Oh, okay, so this is this is quick. Is it really 21? Uh okay, I could have swore it was 24. Well anyway, um plus 21,000. So we need 24,700 divided by 6600. So it's going to take us four more days only. Oh, that's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. Alright, well, we'll finish that for sure. So let's go ahead and hearth. Postmaster. Oh, I got the loot in the in the mail from the boss. Hey, Garrett Cold and I. Oh. You're obviously watching this well after he debuts for the season. 
I have a feeling he's gonna get ejected tonight. <laughs> That's my prediction. He's kind of known for retaliating a little bit. Oh, there we go. No actual bundle of threads, though? Well, that's fine. But yeah, so that's going to be it for us. We'll be back in the next episode, and yeah, four more episodes of us farming TOT, I guess. I still want to try Heroic Mogushan especially. Still haven't done Terrace of the Endless Spring, and we have yet to enter at all Siege of Orgamar. But I'm definitely going to wait on Siege, because that one, obviously, the harder... The harder it gets, the more benefit it is to waiting. So let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in the next episode.